was well, a bright start to our day. We saw a good amount of sunshine during the first half of the day, but the clouds have certainly rolled on in as we've made our way into the afternoon. In fact, you take a look at our Agawam sky cam. You can see skies are mostly cloudy out there. We are dry, though, and I do expect us to remain mainly dry as we head through the evening and into the overnight. But beyond that, our weather pattern is starting to look a bit more unsettled, basically uh, for the remainder of the week. Right now, 34 here in Springfield, so a bit more seasonable out there this afternoon. Suddenly wind right now at 8 miles per hour. That does make it feel a little bit chillier. It feels like it's 27 right now here in Springfield. So we do have the clouds out there, some flurry snow showers developing, but a lot of this probably not reaching the ground. Air mass still pretty dry out there. So I expect overall it is going to be a dry evening tonight, but then things are going to start to change as we head on into tomorrow. You can see low pressure over the central portion of the United States. Some of this will begin to approach the region as we head on into the day tomorrow with a warm front approaching. So overall tonight we're going to be just fine though. Mainly cloudy skies and a dry start tomorrow morning. However, as we head towards the afternoon, that warm front will begin to approach, so we'll see some light snow begin to develop. Now, I do expect temperatures as the precipitation begins to be above the freezing mark. So main roads probably are just going to be wet tomorrow afternoon into tomorrow evening. We get towards the late evening and into the overnight. Temperatures dip down into the upper 20s, some lower 30s, so there could be some slick spots overnight. And as we get going on a Wednesday morning as well, and it could, this could even end as a bit of a mix before the precipitation winds on down. But then as that system moves on out, another system will approach as we head on into Wednesday afternoon, late in the day and into the evening. Although this looks like it's going to be mainly rain, could be a little bit of mixing from time to time. And then temperatures continue to climb as we head towards the end of the week. So precipitation does look like it is going to be mainly rain for Thursday and into a Friday. But certainly looking a bit unsettled around here over the next couple of days. Now, as far as snowfall amounts tomorrow night into Wednesday morning, relatively light, a coating to maybe an inch or two uh, in the lower valley. You get into Berkshire County and some of the higher elevations along the east slopes of the Berkshires, maybe one to three inches before this winds on down on Wednesday morning. And then, of course, with rain possibly moving in by Wednesday afternoon, we'll certainly see a little bit of melting begin to take place. But certainly going to be unsettled around here over the next couple of days. Temperatures, though, going to be in the mid to upper 30s Tuesday and Wednesday. By the time we get on into Thursday, though, we'll see temperatures approaching the lower 40s. And we'll also be in the 40s as we head towards the end of the week on Friday, but still going to be dealing with the threat for some rain during the first half of the day. We'll dry things out on Saturday, temperatures in the mid 40s, but then maybe watching another system as we head towards the end of the weekend and into the beginning of next week. Let's check your forecast. Have a great afternoon. Abby, Chris, over to you. All right.